Good morning, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew Daily Events Worldwide, and we're on July 10th, 2019. Welcome to another surviving day on this planet. Welcome to another video for Morning Dew. We'll start out here looking at our sun as we have that coronal hole activity that's been affecting us the last couple days. As well, we have a small sunspot region firing up in the south. Amazing images coming in here from Solar Dynamics Observatory. No major sun activity to talk about, but we are, we are going to talk about is our magnetosphere, which was majorly disturbed on the 8th. I'm just going to show you here the magnus, magnus, magnetosphere maps. You can see on the left there the increase in, in the activity. The wind speed around our planet incoming. Things definitely ramped up. And yesterday we had the peak retrograde with Saturn. So right there, you can see that large pulse and disturbance in our magnetosphere. This was recorded on the 8th. Wow, that's a big punch, double punch actually. Let's get to the earthquakes last 24 hours. Largest being the 5.6 Indonesia. Still watching many aftershocks. Literally thousands. We're recording 4,000 aftershocks in California. 5.5 here in Russia at a 437 kilometer depth. And last night, 5.6. The Philippines, Dolo, Philippines. Uh, kind of looks like we're missing some earthquakes here. Need to get an upgrade here. Uh, 3.0, California. Yeah, let's just get this. This doesn't seem right. There's more earthquakes here. There, there we go. That's the last 24 hours. So yeah, deep earthquake, Russia. As well, 5.5 or 5.6 Philippines, 5.2 yesterday, Raul Island, New Zealand, 4.6 Medayog, Indonesia, 4.5 Afghanistan, 3.3 Greece. But literally, the earthquakes have been happening all over. Atlantic Plate, South American Plate, Indian Plate, 5.7 here, notable in Iran two days ago. Yeah, I apologize, I did not upload yesterday. I really needed the day off. I've been super busy with work and as well this channel. I needed a day of rest. So I want to thank you all for joining and I, I appreciate your support and your loyalty. Last seven days, deep earthquake event seems to have stopped. Looking here at the Pacific Disaster Center, the latest disasters from around the world. Just want to zoom in here on, uh, on California. You can see it's still moving north, all of those aftershocks. And volcano update, Reventador, Popo, Nevados de Chilean, Sabancaya, Sengang, Api in Indonesia. 
those are all the most recently updated erupting volcanoes still experiencing a heat wave in Ontario and then over parts of Alaska where they've seen a heat wave this last week there are some fires let's have a look here at NASA worldview you can see the smoke a lot of smoke and something strange I noticed here look at those lines where does that come from that is not natural just saying let's overlook Alaska here the last few days Wow, eh? It's a lot of smoke. I just noticed this big fire here. That's a new one. So stay aware, prepared. Alaska, heat waves over, but the fires are not. So, Gulf of Mexico, we do have a tropical storm forming in the next couple days that will be attacking New Orleans and Texas State later in the week. We'll see what Tropical Storm Barry potentially is his name. We'll see how she forms in the Gulf of Mexico. Let's get to the five-day forecast brought to you by Meteor Earth, Meteo Mike, overlooking North America, Midwestern states, some nasty storms brewing, and moving across into Canada. Alberta still watching some unstable air, so... Thursday is the big day there for thunderstorms. United States showing here that low pressure system, which was a very strong low and developed just north of the Florida Panhandle. It's set to, set to drive into the Gulf of Mexico. Gain strength. And then head straight north into New Orleans and Texas. South America, no major events to talk about. Possibility of a tropical storm developing in the Atlantic Ocean. Argentina will be getting smacked again with another snowfall as those low pressure centers are heading east and they're very strong and huge. Just look at the size of these things. They're the size of Antarctica. That's crazy. Uh, you know, and I've seen some big storms down here before, but I haven't seen two like this at the same time. Just saying. Overlooking Europe, low pressure centers coming from the north and moving east. Cool down throughout United Kingdom. And then... Watch for a low pressure convergence here, hitting the high. And we will have some thunderstorms, some extreme weather events. Nepal and this large low pressure center over Pakistan still bringing some extreme weather events as well. Over the next few days, they are seeing some mass amounts of rain. And straight out that atmospheric river. Look at that. Then looking in the Pacific Ocean, there is a lot of rain falling. Watch for a large tropical typhoon to develop in the next couple weeks. over parts of Papua New Guinea, Cal New Caledonia. I want to thank you for watching today. This has been Mike with Morning Dew Daily Events Worldwide. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun and get your morning dew. Thanks for watching today. Don't forget to hit that like button. Share with your friends and family from around the world. Bye-bye.